You know, in, in the end, it's really simple. There's a lot of knife sharpeners out there, uh, you know, on the market. And if you don't believe me, go into Sportsman's Warehouse and take a look. There's about 50 knife sharpeners ranging from eh, three or four or five dollars to a real cheap one to 150 200 dollars why should you buy mine it's real simply uh put there's a family of four the littlest one okay then there's a rectangle a long handle and a sharpened spark they're all small they're all pocketable you take them with you they're lightweight they're inexpensive they're durable they last this is kind of like a generational thing you don't lose this the carbide's not going to wear out. Give it to your kids, your grandkids, you know, things like that. Pocketable. Goes everywhere with you. 43 different types of things and blades that I can sharpen. You know, I mean, like axes, hatchets, hose, shovels, planter blades, draw knives, all your pruners, hedge trimmers, grass trimmers, side dykes, ten snips, serrated edge blades, scissors, okay, just goes on and on. Buy the uh, Handy Sharp, okay, on sharpensbest.com. Take a look at the YouTube videos, decide which one you want, learn how to use it. That's why you buy Handy Sharp from sharpensbest.com. Hi, this is Brad with Sharpens Best. We have a new product, and it's called the uh, Sharpens Park Mini. And it's a lot of fun. Uh, it's got a, a couple of, uh, it's got one extra thing on it, but there's two features about it um, that are really cool. So this is the $35 set. You get the rectangular one and the mini, Sharp and Spark Mini. So we dumped that out of there. And first thing I'm going to show you is, is it does have a bottle opener right here on the end. Then instead of uh, being longer, they fatten the head a little bit, put the spark clear up in, shortened it. So actually, we'll stand them up here right side by side. And the new one's about an inch and a half shorter than the original Sharpen Sparks. And this is called the Mini, Sharpen Spark Mini. And so you do have a little bit shorter. I take this right off here, the key ring, and then it's very pocketable. It does have the bottle opener in the end right here. It still has the reshaper, the sharpener. And then in the handle, just like the big one, we have the spark. It's called ferrocerium rod. It's actually six different types of rare metals. So we do have the uh, spark in the handle. It's got paint on it, so we'll wear some of the paint off. And there's your sparks. And it's called the Sharpen Spark Mini. Kind of a cute little thing. Goes right in your pocket. You can reshape a blade by drawing it through the V. I use the open face and the two corners most. And then we have an emergency tool on the end of it. Well, what's the emergency tool? Well, bottle opener. Sharp and Spark Mini. Come to YouTube, Sharp and Spark. Take a look. You'll like them, just like our other products. This is Brad, sharpensbest.com. Take care and have a good day. Specializing in education, Brad offers knife sharpeners, flashlights, and the best American-made survival and pack stoves on the market. We basically want a tool that's going to work in your situation. My mission statement, I guess, would be this. You know, teach people how to use tools that benefit their life in the best way. Okay, that's a Buck 119. That's a brand new knife. It's got a, a bone handle on it. A friend of mine makes these. Now this knife, new, didn't cut like this, but I tune them up. And if you can make a knife cut like that, clear out to the tip, let me cut that off. If you can cut like this, that's sharp. Paper's a strange thing, it's tough, but it's also flimsy. Buck 119. Hi, this is Brad. How you doing? I'd like to show you how to make a fire with a sharpened spark mini, okay, and just a little accelerant on a little bit of grass down in a hole in a rock, and it's going to look just like this. And all you gotta do is put a little bit of sticks and stuff on top of it. Next thing you know, you got your nice fire. And if you find a little hole in a rock, you got a little uh, fire pit right there. Take care, have a good day. This is Brad. Go to YouTube, watch our videos, Sharpens Best, 
and you know just learn how to how to sharpen things different things you know enjoy the scenery enjoy the fun i travel a lot good scenery uh youtube sharpens best this is brad take care have a good day because you go through your life using all kinds of tools no matter where they are whether you're recreation or work or just around home and things get dull if you use them they get dull it's all there is to it sharpening them yourself instead of having to buy new ones or get them sharpened by somebody else is really important because you just get the job done, you continue on with what you're doing. Believe me, you can't sharpen things without the education. <laughs>